a new control object type can be found, and here it is. It's called the volume deform. So I'm just going to go ahead and select that, scale it down to about here, and now let's just go ahead and position it here near the front of uh, front of our character. So we'll go ahead and close this up, select the geometry that you'd like to apply the deformer to, and uh, then simply deform by volume. Select the deformer, and uh, I can now control let's keep this open. Can move this around. You can see how that reacts. I can also rotate this if I like, like this. You have a start damping point here. If I pull this out, you can see how that works, like this. And lastly, you can quickly uh, hook up and unhook the deformer by going into your component there. And uh, you can see it's Shift V, or just go ahead and click this. So I'll first click it. And I'll just move this over here, press Shift V again, and now I can go ahead and move that. So you can see it makes a very quick sculpting tool as well.